I 3D printed the brand new PlayStation 5. First, we measured all the dimensions, figured out how we wanted to do it. We bought an expensive 3D printer and 3D printed the PlayStation 5. While most people are paying $500 for theirs, mine was absolutely free. It turned out insane. We're the first people on YouTube to do this. So make sure you watch it the whole way through and leave a big thumbs up. Legit Nation, I present to you the first ever person in the whole entire world to get an Xbox Series X early. Or you thought it was early because this is a replica one of one made Xbox One. I made it about six months ago. I didn't show you guys the process, but here it is. And today we're about to make a PS5. If y'all want to know how to win a free PS5, stay till the end because I'm going to be giving those out as well. This is Larry. Larry is the engineer behind all the projects. So everything from the Supreme truck to the Supreme bike to the Xbox, everything is done with Larry. So we're going to go ahead and check out what we got here today. All right. So this is mini PS5. And the only reason we would have to do mini is because if we make it out of acrylic, these side pieces would be a right. pain to okay. bend. Larry has a lot of tools that he's able to build like crazy ideas from. And so what we're going to do is we're going to use a 3D printer to print out the PS5. I think this is going to be the first time. Has anybody ever done this before? I have not. Not like this. Not like this. So make sure you slap that big thumbs up. All right. So we're out here at the warehouse because we're getting material because we're going to build another PS5. Appreciate it, brother. No problem. Y'all have a good one. You too. All right. So we got a bunch of big sheets of like acrylic. So it's going to be all like super, super white, like the color of the PlayStation. I don't know if you guys can see that, but we're going to make another model that's going to be life size since the other one's too small. It's going to be crazy. Baby, here we go. Here we go. That's it right there. So now we gotta paint it. All right. Mm. That looks sick. Miniature model. PlayStation 5. First ever 3D printed PlayStation 5. That's crazy. Now we gotta add the rubbing alcohol to it. Let's see the Sony. Okay, so right now we're about to spray paint the PS5 right now. We got the 3D printed, that white colorway. Here we go, here we go, here we go. I got my boy doing it because I know that if I do it, it's gonna come out very, very sloppy and I'm gonna mess it up. You got that nice white finish, you already know, making it look like a true 3D printed PS5. So we were thinking about 3D printing a giant PS5. It would take like, what, like you said days? Yeah, because we have to do it in pieces. So, okay, you're, so you're spraying the middle white first. Yeah, just to give to it a base the and then we're gonna do it in black. I can't wait for it to like actually be fun, but it's gonna look like an actual PS5, it's gonna be sick. So we're drying off the PS5 right now. All the paint's gonna dry. We got the Milwaukee on here. My boy only uses Milwaukee gear, okay? And then next, we're gonna go ahead and tape it up and mm -hmm. we're gonna spray paint the inside black. It's gonna be sick, but we're, we still gotta work on, we still gotta work on the bigger one. Cause we're not only gonna 3D print it, we're gonna actually make one out of acrylic similar to the Xbox. You're doing type. all of that? We're doing all of it for this video. So I make thought sure you were just stuff. making this. No, 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 no. We gotta make lit content Dang, for them. Dang, you're lit literally content. making okay. lit content Here we go, we're for taping it up. Dang. Take Taping it up so that way it doesn't get on the white part. Legit nation, y'all better give this a like right now because he's literally doing the most. So these are the dimensions of the new place of the PlayStation 5. And this boy is a big boy. Like he's massive. Like I've had every system from the PS1, Xbox original. And ever since then, this is gonna be the biggest one, bro. This is crazy, dude. So we gotta get the dimensions so that way we can make the exact size up to proportion of the real one. So this has been every single system up to the point of the PS5. And out of everything, the PS5 is the biggest. So it's gonna have to be huge. So right now we got the acrylic that we picked up on the laser printer. So it's going to be cutting out. First, what we're going to work on is we're going to work on the shell. So the outside part of the PlayStation. But right now we got it on the laser. It's looking pretty good. It's going to cut all around and it's just basically lasering straight through the plastic. Oh, little fire might start here and there. Got this big machine my boy Larry invested in. It's a laser printer. Okay, so here we go. We got the actual shell part out of the 3D printer right now. I don't have nails, but... You got it, you got it, you got it. Cut it exactly to the dimension of the PlayStation that's gonna come. There it is, this is the color right here. The outside of the PlayStation, that nice clean white. So this is gonna be the outside barrier for it and we're gonna have an inside piece as well. Got the inside of the PS4, the actual black part. Putting the finishing touches on the mini PS4, PS5 with the nice black paint on it. 
This is gonna make it look super legit. It's gonna make it look super sick. Cause with the insides filled, it's gonna look like an actual PS5 now, miniature. That's insane to me. Oh shoot, dude. This actually looks freaking legit, look, man. That's where you put mini games. Yo, I can't wait to show you guys it with the tape off. Cause when we reveal it to you, it's gonna be crazy. But let's go back and see the acrylic PS5. And then we're gonna do the big reveal of both of them together. So you guys can see what we created. Okay, so we're heating up the middle part of the PS5 gonna curve it and then we're gonna put the tackle shell around it this is gonna be essentially the part you put the CD in and the part where like you turn it on the inside of it so inside of the tackle shell so we're gonna go ahead and morph this right now with the heat gun using it and then we're gonna wrap it around itself turn it into the inside it's gonna look sick you can kind of see it bending already it bends itself yeah yeah dang it's that flimsy now all right that's not even that like that's crazy because like without the heat it's like really really hard to bend but with the heat that was quick forming the top of it right now forming the top of it bending this hard black piece that's crazy how easy it bends with heat because without heat it's like really 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 tough like see how tough it is guys so that's crazy this is gonna turn out dope so this is a really cool process i'm really glad i get to show you guys building an actual ps5 because none of your other youtubers are gonna be doing this right now but we're showing you guys a process do me a favor and leave a big thumbs up right now let us know what else do you want to see us build down in the comments down below my boy larry like i said if you guys can think about it we'll make it happen he'll make it happen got that flame torch on right now gonna bend it over with the torch All right, Legit Nation, now what you've all been waiting for, the official reveal of our PlayStation 5. And here we have it. This one is the 3D printed model that we painted over it. So the 3D printer took 10 hours making this. We didn't even show you guys, but it took 10 hours to make this model of the PS5. This came out really, really sick. I love the way that it turned out. And then this one is an acrylic version of it, which we laser engraved, cut the pieces, glued them together. We got a little PlayStation logo right there. I don't know who did that. So Sony, if you're wondering, I, some guy down the road, if you want his info, I, I gave it to you. But uh, yeah, man, so we have a nice, clean, clean version of the PlayStation. It's really simple. It's a model. We didn't want to just give you guys this little thing because we couldn't laser this thing massive. It would have taken like two weeks to do that on a big laser. We went ahead and made this ourselves. This one's really, really cool, honestly. I really, really like the way that this one turned out. This is like a life-size model of what the PlayStation is going to look like. So stay tuned. We're going to be buying the PlayStation. PlayStation 5 tomorrow, and we're also gonna be giving some away. So make sure you leave a big thumbs up on this video, and we'll see y'all guys in the next one. Peace, homies, stay blessed. We're out of here.